coming out. He's like, yo. With the homies. Yeah, what? Come on. The things that he invented are here. Oh my gosh. We lost Gunner like a thousand times. If she goes upside down, boom, she dies. Boom, she dies? That's her choice. My favorite mural, right across from Green Eggs Cafe. Boy, take my way. Who knows the guys in Sinaloa? Shimmy, 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 shimmy. As you know, we're in Philadelphia. We stayed at the Sinaloa Hotel. So what is it? A purple peach smoothie. What is that? Blueberries, peaches, peach nectar, and honey. Is that good for me? Of course it is. Should I? But then I still want breakfast. See, that's the thing. I still want food. That is food. It's, it's, it's literally... No, but I want bacon. Okay. <laughs> then get bacon, just the bacon. That one. Look how cute this place is. Wait, so how did... You... And tell them, every, t every time we've come to Philly, we've eaten here for breakfast. So and why? I don't know. Homegrown. Didn't you say like homegrown or organic or... Local products. They recycle all glass, aluminum, papers, plastics. Composite all food. Forbid the use of styrofoam or plastic. Invest in biodegradable to-go wear and conserve water. Tu libro. Do you know where this is? This is where Benjamin Franklin lived and worked. Oh, these very streets. These very streets. This block right here, right? Yeah, he's probably hung out. He's like, yo, with the homies. Yeah, what, Juan? Thomas Edison. <laughs> You're walking the same block he did. Isn't that crazy? And you got my book. So if you don't, don't follow our vlogs, or you're new to this channel, you don't know that Diana loves Benjamin Franklin. And I got this book originally in the library. It's from Jean Beretta. The only reason I picked the book was like, okay, it's educational. The illustrations are amazing. I think she'll like it. I love all his books. He has something on uh, uh, Muhammad Ali and a few other people, but it, I loved it. And she ended up loving Benjamin Franklin. So we're going somewhere special. And, and, this, and that's how he looks like, you know. <laughs> you're interested in Jean Beretta books? I will leave them linked in the description box below. I'm telling you, his books are really, 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 really good and they're all informative. So. Oh, you want to go Benjamin Franklin's path? Huh? Two this there, nah. And no, it's everywhere, baby. He was everywhere. Really? Yeah. Also, a huge thank you to Visit Philly, who hooked us up with some media passes to see a lot of the amazing museums they have here. Um, right now, we're going somewhere so special. I'm so excited. I might cry because it, it is going to be so so excited. Wow, that's where we're going. That's where we're going. Hey Buddha, come on. I think we found his footsteps. Yeah! Daddy has some knowledge to spit right now. So you know this right here, these, these stones, this the original stones that Benjamin Franklin rode his horse. Su caballo. Remember, because back then there were no cars, right? So cool. That's, pro that, that's probably where he came up with one invention. What invention do you think he came up with? I'm asking, he come, came up with the long gun, the bifocals, and the... I think I have to look The back. chair, which is the chair one? Oh, the... The chair that turns? Butter yeah. and the top. Ooh, Good job. Oh. Do you think that's the first one that he invented? 
Remember, because what else did he invent? The buildings, the office, and the library, and the firemen. The fire department, uh -huh. police station, that's what he created, right? Remember? Oh, so let's go in. In fact, the first post office he created. Guys, and it's a real working post office. I mean, like this is so cool. See this frame? That is where he had his printing press. Walk all the way back there where Boyto is. That's where he had his house. So the buildings are gone, but they still framed it so you could see it. That is amazing. He's on a Vivia, that's where he lives. You see the frame? Look at the frame of the house. You see a house? You wanna take a picture in su casa? Yeah. What is that, Nana? Um, was the thing, the glass bowls. The, gra the glass what? The glass bowls. Uh, the harmonica? Harmonica. Harmonica, wait, is it, is it that? Yeah, it is. But I don't know how to play. Nana, that's the one he really made. Oh, when I'm playing that, you're so happy. No, it's not the same thing, okay. <laughs> It's a replica. Oh, it's a replica? Oh. Oh, yeah, wait, that's too clean. <laughs> that's amazing. Jim and Franklin wouldn't write his, la his name, right? He would, he would make up names. Isn't that funny? Like the Abigail, Twitter Fields, Busybody, Dr. Fat Sides, America, Ain't America, and Anus Fart Hing. <laughs> Get them. How do I get them? <laughs> oh, we can, baby. Whoa. What are they? What are these? What's that? What's that? What is that? I don't think I'm aware. The odometer. The odometer. Good job, baby. We made it at Betsy Ross's house. Last time we came, we didn't have tickets and we were like in a rush because we had to head back to the whole, I don't know, whatever it was. But now we could finally get in. Thanks to Visit Philly. I'm here to see Betsy. <laughs> She'll be inside the house. Wait, that's real? Hot dogs are better with Betsy Ross buns? Oh my gosh. That's Betsy Ross bread. Wonder where you can get that. <laughs> Betsy. Betsy, where you at, Bets? Say Betsy. This is her room. You're not Betsy. Is this her room or someone else's room? Um, her. Is it? Is that Nana? The, what is that? La bandera. Did you see how it's different? It was like a circle, star yeah, circles going go through. Betsy, is that you? Perhaps I need to introduce myself, my dear. Oh. More formally, my name is Mrs. Elizabeth Ashburn. Oh. But most individuals do seem to be a bit more familiar with my first husband's name of Ross and my nickname of Betsy. Uh, Betsy, of oh. course, friends, simply a short name of Elizabeth. Oh, it is Betsy. I have heard such names are still quite popular in your day. Names that are long but can be shortened to something else. Yes. Do any of you friends perhaps have such a name? No, but my name is Betsy. But you are not an Elizabeth? No, I'm not an Elizabeth. Interesting. <laughs> Fashions must have changed. I see that attire has changed quite a bit. Isn't your clothes different from hers, from Betsy's? Do you wear that? Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. Having your legs exposed, ladies, quite sad. Ooh, your legs. <laughs> we put it in jail, Nana. <laughs> but are you friends enjoying your visit to my home? 
Yeah, that's beautiful. Is it perhaps a first visit or a second or even a third? First. First. Ah, first for all. Well, other questions then, since it is a first visit. Why are the stairs so small? <laughs> the reason the stairs are quite small is because the home itself is rather small. Of course, it would not do to have a large and grand staircase taking mm. a valuable floor space. So why can't we go all the way up to the roof? <laughs> so, I do not own this home. I am a boarder here. I rent. I rent this chamber for my work, as well as my bed chamber for sleeping. It is the one directly above. I have a question for you. Ooh. I imagine you are visiting because you have heard I make flags. Yes? Yes. <laughs> my question for you. I began fashioning flags in June of 1776 when three gentlemen came to see me. Do you remember one of the gentlemen's Mommy, names? Mommy, who is it? It is a gentleman I'm certain you have heard of. Betsy Ross, man. Have you heard of General Washington? See? See? <laughs> yes. Yeah. I can bet you all. No, I am not an upholsterer like Betsy Ross. And no, I do not live here at all. And also, no, I cannot make a flag to save my life. <laughs> the Betsy Ross house, definitely something that is worth seeing. So I like that it was interactive. It was small, it was tiny, it was interesting, it was cute, it was colonial. A lot of history. And we're stuck in the rain again. <laughs> And what's going to be our cheer? This is our first huddle, family huddle. Let's go, science knowledge. Let's go, science no, but knowledge. but it has to be, no. It has to be like a thing that we're going to do every time. Oh, wait, wait, what are we doing? Okay. Shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy on the way. Right. So now we're at the Franklin Institute. Ooh. Oh. Ziana. Ziana, look at that. I'm doing that. Ever wonder why it's impossible to tip yourself? Don't look at it. Why? Because it's your brain. It's because your brain plans movements before making them. So you would never. Oh, so you. Eliminating the element of surprise okay. that is essential to being tickled. So you expect it. Hey, go. <laughs> didn't, didn't expect that, did you? We're going on a roller coaster. It's gonna go all the way up and all the way down. Like at Disney, remember when you got scared of it? Ooh. <laughs> we're upside down. I feel like we're upside down. We are upside down. Sometimes the visual system and your balance system disagree. I feel like I'm floating. We're floating on that, we're upside down. <gasps> This is awesome. Look at this. I don't like it. No, no, no. 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 No, the screen was moving and it made us feel like we were going upside down, but we weren't. Your brain plays tricks on you sometimes. When they see things are off balance, what is it? What was it when it's off balance? When I did, I know we're upside down. We didn't go upside it down. It felt like I, I, it. I'm no. dying. You're dying. You're dying. You're dying. Yeah. You're dying. No, no, I didn't. You're dying. No. <laughs> no. I didn't. to read a word as opposed to look at the color. Mm, you see a brain. But the real problem is the difference is you have two hemispheres in your brain, two sides to your brain, left and right. 
One side processes the color and the other side processes the word. Next part of the Institute, the Franklin Institute, is all this magic. Public service announce announcement. Please bring your family to Philadelphia. It's not even a spo sponsored trip. I really wish it was. I mean, we got the free passes, thankfully. But this museum, by far, even in New York, like, um, the science museum in the city is not great. Like this is so interactive. It's so very cool. Hands on. I really recommend if you come Franklin Museum. It's a little pricey. What is it? Franklin Institute. What is it? 30 30 40 dollars, but I mean it's it's huge. Huge. like a thousand times. Papi, papi. He's only crying because I told him not. What happened? Oh, he didn't even realize. No, he was hanging out with somebody else. Who? Some lady. He was asking, saying, dada, dada, dada. You guys can say I want to say mommy and daddy, right? Okay? I want to mommy and daddy. Aquí. That's why we say mano, right? Okay? No running. Okay, papi? She's scared of a movie. <laughs> Tell your brain to stop. So sadness, go home. Only built sections of the wall are also still standing. Oh my goodness, are you so scared? I'm happy, I love it. I'm gonna get on the sky bike. I can't wear flip flops, so I'm wearing boy toys sneakers. Pedal backwards to go backwards. You get to go two times. What's her choice, Nana? What's gonna goes, happen? If she goes upside down, boom, she dies. Boom, she dies? That's her choice. That's her choice? There we go. I'll go You'd be the first. Be the first. Oh, Do it. Actually, actually, yeah. actually she won't be So is it worth it? Oh yeah. Okay, so uh oh, Gunner's too hey, racing. Vas a correr? Ready, set, go! Corre, 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 corre! <laughs> Put it in. Put it in. Ah! <laughs> You need a cheese, what is it? Cheese steak. Cheese steak. Cheese steak. And there's two rivals here. So we went with Gino's. I think this is my first official Philly cheesesteak. Just like first time ever having Philly cheesesteak or first time having Philly cheesesteak in Philly? I don't know. Okay, guys. I don't get it. Well, this is absolute trash. Listen guys. Philly cheesesteak sucks. It's last season. Boy Toy totally liked it. He's like, blah, 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 whatever. Me no me gusta. But now we're on to the dessert. It is, what is it called? The, the Franklin Fountain. We've been doing everything Ben Franklin today because we show respect to the most wonderful inventor in history. There he is. There he is. Santa Mama. Okay, okay. 
Buenas noches mis amigos, thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe if you haven't, if you enjoyed this vlog. We would love to, for you to be part of the Amigos. And with that, Buenas noches! Mm -hmm. for watching mis amigos make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and definitely comment below it will help us on youtube and until next time adios, adios.